Recently, Nintendo held a Nintendo Direct right here on YouTube, and if you're not familiar with these, they're basically Nintendo's version of E3, where they showcase new games and such that are exclusive to Nintendo. But anyway, if you've watched the most recent Direct, you know what we're talking about today. While watching the gameplay trailer for Super Mario Bros. Wonder, I and many others caught onto something that can only be described as... worrying. Of course, I'm not talking about the gameplay itself, that looks incredible in every way and I'll for sure be picking up this game to play on the channel, but instead I'm going to talk about something that I believe is way more important right now. Something that has been a mainstay for a whopping 27 years, ever since Super Mario 64. Something that certain fans are very defensive over. Yep, that's right, today we're talking about Mario's voice. More specifically, the changes in Mario's voice that I and many others noticed. Now let me explain. Throughout the trailer we see Luigi, Toad, and Peach, and even Daisy, and their voices sound just as great as usual, but Mario's? Well, just take a listen for yourself. <laughs> If you listen closely to the clips, you'll notice Mario's voice sounds drastically different than it normally does. It honestly kinda sounds like the beta voice from Mario 64. Now, I actually do want to talk about the movie briefly because that is the only other recent example of Nintendo switching out Mario's voice for a replacement. In that case, Mario ended up being voiced by Chris Pratt rather than Charles Martinet who originally voices him. And at least for that movie, in my opinion, it worked out fine. Of course, make sure to watch that movie if you haven't already, it's on digital now. But that right there shows us Nintendo's willingness to change things up. So back to the question, is Mario being voiced by Charles Martinet in Super Mario Bros. Wonder? My guess Yes is no, and I'll tell you why. A little bit before the Mario Bros movie was released, a lot of fans were asking Charles Martinet if he voiced Mario somewhere later in the film, and his response was that he is not an actor. And I mean, he is technically right. He never even says more than wahoo or let's a go in the games. So why would he voice Mario in the movie? But anyway, going by that logic, if Nintendo ever wanted to, I don't know, make Mario talk in the games, would they replace Charles? But okay, I know what you're thinking. There's no proof Nintendo has plans on making Mario speak full sentences. But to that, dear viewer, I ask to look again. In the very same Nintendo Direct where all this started, you'll find a trailer for the official remake of Mario RPG. Yes, like a full remake of the SNES game that's gone forgotten in the eyes of Nintendo until now. And it looks great. Fantastic even. And judging by the addition of more voice acting in the Mario Bros. Wonder trailer, I'm willing to bet the Mario RPG remake has also got itself some new spangled voice acting in it too. Now, I want to clarify something because I can just hear you guys commenting now. Mario doesn't actually speak in that game. He talks to the other characters and it's implied he's speaking full sentences, but we never actually hear him, so why would he need a new voice actor? Well, it's just a hunch, but my guess is that Nintendo is planning on adding a lot more voice acting into their games, as evident by all the newly added voice acting in the Mario Bros. Wonder gameplay trailer. And with all this in mind, it suddenly becomes more plausible for this to be the case. This could totally be Nintendo's way of introducing more voice acting for Mario. And if that's actually their plan, and if they are actually changing voice actors, then I'm afraid Mario Odyssey was Charles's last game as the Italian plumber. I guess we'll just have to wait and see for sure. But seriously guys, this game actually looks phenomenal, I'll 100% be buying this and playing it for the channel. I love the new art style and I really really hope Nintendo sticks with this type of aesthetic moving forward. It's just so colorful and bright and it just brings me so much joy. 10 out of 10 Nintendo, 10 out of 10, great job. Anyway guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and hey, while you're already down there, might as well subscribe and hit the bell so you know when more videos come out. It's free so you literally have nothing to lose. Alright everyone, that's it from me. I love every single one of you with all of my heart. Thank you so much for watching.